pet, you know, you can provide it with food and water, and then you just leave it there and it'll live. But I realized that, you know, the community, like communities, you can't do that with a community. You can't leave just, okay, yeah, you just throw a, little, a couple of little food stores here and there, you know, a convenience store, and then let the, the community live, you know, because that's not how it is. Because as people, you know, as, as a neighborhood that thrives and grows, you know, we need, the, we need people to care. We need people to actually come and not just do something once and then just leave it and be like, okay, bye. But we need people to actually keep the ongoing stuff, which is what we have now with um, Tropicana, you know, they're, they're, they came out with something, you know, and it's still going on. And I realized that that's something that was lacking because every time in the community where we find something good, it would be gone after a little while. So, you know, it has to be like that it can't just be something that just comes up and goes away. There has to be an ongoing process with it, you know. We can't just leave, so we can't just leave the community after saying, okay, we gave them something, and then after that should be good enough to suffice.